Okay, here's the Exos 48 by Osprey, just outside of Yosemite here. And the first time I've taken it out, I think it's awesome. It rides really well. I had a little bit more weight in it because I had all the dogs' food and I was sleeping that and um, a couple jackets for the dog. It does have a small bear canister in it. BB. Uh, 40, no, 450, which is like four days, and it takes up 50% of the time. So that's a problem. But I have a tent in here. I have a, it's the Big Agnes Fly Creek high volume two person. I also have a new quilt in here, so super light quilt, um, a jet boil, and I went relatively light on clothes. That's basically what I brought. But you see, the problem is this uh, bear vault takes up so much space. If you put the full one in here, it would be 80% of your pack. So just so you know. Other than that, I used the lid and you can take it off, save some weight. I used it, I might go to just a few um, sacks. But it's a sweet pack, it feels great. The mesh on the back is phenomenal. You can look up the specs, you don't need it. If you're watching YouTube, you know how to use the internet. So the 48's a little small if you're gonna put a full bear canister in it. And that was really what I was testing, so hopefully it helps you guys. Come on out and play. It's not bad. So here's my mini bear vault. It's half the size, it's the 450, not the 500. It's good for four days, not seven to 10. And that thing really fills that up. You can put it in vertically. You don't have to put it in sideways or flat. And it doesn't bother your back because of the mesh section here. So there's a space between this mesh and your back so it doesn't push into your back even if you don't pad it perfectly which is pretty sweet but I mean this thing's really not that big and it fills up that 48 on the bottom I've got a catabatic gear quilt and uh, that's it man so it's a super lightweight 20 degree quilt that plus that and the packs pretty much full okay take care